running away. So sorry, Sam. I wish there was something I can do. Danny. Danny, I don't know if you can hear me. But I love you. So much. And I tried. I tried really hard to protect you. Don't cry, Sam. You're awake. I'm really tired. I know, baby. I'm so glad Mom and Dad made you my sister. He loved me always, when no one else did. I will always, always love you. Was I a good enough boy to get into heaven? Are you kidding me? Any angel would welcome you with open arms. Wings. Everybody knows angels have wings. My bad. I want to see them. Who, Danny? The angels. They're coming closer. When you get there, will you say hello to your niece for me? Keep an eye out for her, please. <laughs> you know, the little girl that I lost. She will make sure that nothing bad happens to you ever. Jason. Was uh, was Sam? She well, here? Elizabeth came and got me. I came in right afterwards. Yes, yeah, Sam was here. She was um. She was sitting with Danny and holding his hand. I'm really worried about her, Jason. She is one sick young lady. Do you know where she went? I sent her back to her room. doctor to examine you to make sure that you're okay. Then I want him to go to the lab and, by the way, I'll hurry up and bottle this stuff. No, you sound delirious. Oh, okay. You need to go back to your bed. No, I don't want to leave you. I look at the bigger picture. The sooner you get better, the sooner we can go home and be with our girls. That's no, okay. Seeing you get better is the best medicine anybody could ever ask for. Mm hmm. Better. I'm thrilled for you. Not that you give a damn, but my brother just died. Sam, I'm so sorry. 
for what happened to Danny. Sam, don't blame Alexis. She didn't pull any kind of strings. It was the doctor's decision to give her the antidote and not your brother. Sure. You're sorry a lot. Aren't you, Alexis? I mean, just sitting here, I can come up with countless situations that have made you sorry. But the thing is, I really don't know where to start. Wait a minute, I guess I should just start at the beginning, right? You were sorry after you screamed at me to save your daughter's life at the expense of my own. You were sorry when my daughter died, but not too sorry to demand her stem cells. You were sorry when you were forced in defending Manny, who is a rapist and a murderer, and you put him back on the streets instead of in a prison cell where he belongs. Okay, that Sam, you were sorry Sam, for. Sam, you're upset. Shut up, Rick. Poor Alexis. Oh, poor, pitiful Alexis. Always desperate. Always sorry. You know what the funny thing is? I thought I actually learned something from you. I thought that you were supposed to fight with everything you have to save your family. But I guess I didn't learn that from you because you are a hypocrite. You walk away with your family intact and me, you know what I have? I have nothing. I have nobody. My family is gone. It is fair. If there was any anything that I could have... Anything that you could have done. Could have. You could have refused the antidote, Alexis. You could have saved my brother's life. You chose not to. How would you feel if Sonny and I chose not to give you the stem cells to save Christina? You could have put a gun to his head and pull a bullet. Sam, Through that would have been the Sam, same. Sam, stop I it. hate you. Do you understand that? I hate you Sam. more than I have ever hated anyone in my entire life. Ah. Sam. Ah. Her fever is dangerously high. And, uh... I'm not sure there's anything we can do to fix it. You gotta find something. Jason, I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know if she's gonna make it through the night. 